Welcome back everyone, I'm Craven, and this is Visions of Mana and we of course are in Milos Woods and if you're wondering why we are here it is basically for one of the quests we've picked up and it needs us to come here in order to beat up some mushrooms in the poison area so that's where we're headed for right now and uh, it was also a good uh, place to uh, grind some experience so I've uh, fought a few enemies here just to uh, keep ourselves busy yeah, I thought there was a thingy here that we could use to summon one of those leaves thingies huh, maybe we can oh wait this is uh, of course the other way around ah See if we can make it. Oh, no. Quickly, or else you'll get poisoned. Uh, well, we we did get poisoned, but it was only with the touch of a toe. Uh, we should we should be fine after one fight. Let's see if we can uh, find the right enemies. I think they should be here. And I should definitely restock uh, on medicinal herbs, especially when you go to a place like this. Uh, I thought there was going to be more of them here. Ah, there they are. All right. I can help you. I need you, thanks. Right, that's one. Ah, good. Put up the tree for healing. But considering other quests we've had in this game, I'm gonna assume we have to find at least five of them. Yes, it's the right enemy at least. Yeah, it's always five, isn't it? Hopefully we can find more. Well, these are the same ones we started. That. I'm gonna assume there should be at least two groups uh, of mushrooms out here, right? Keep your guard up walking through here. Well, that is the idea. And then when I see a group, potentially at least. Heal up if needed. Here. I can help you. Here. And two more. Oh, three more. That should be plenty. Understood. Looks like I got my hands on a pretty rare find. You did. And there it is. Mushroom stem soup. So if we now go to a random point, we can just warp out of here. And since this is considered a new area... Uh, sanctuary entry... There it is. Yeah, we need to travel down the cliff before we can uh, warp all the way down there. Alright, let's see uh, where did we 
did that quest though. Was that here? Yeah, it was. Oh, oh you found the mushroom stems. Thanks, Solgard. I was about ready to uh, use a different ingredient to make the broth. <laughs> I tell my dad that uh, you found these. I'm sure he'll be thrilled. This is nowhere near enough to compensate you for your troubles, but uh, here, I hope you can accept this. That was a great new experience. Uh, 6,000 in cash. That's what we need to replenish. And if I remember correctly, I did think I mentioned at the end of the last episode that I would start at Tiania. So let's go there right now, shall we? Uh, back home once again. And now there are quests. Good. Let's pick them up and see what they want us uh, our help with. Well, when I was a kid, I remember reading a story about a soul guard who met a group of friendly monsters. It was a heartfelt tale unlike anything I've ever read before. Ever since then, it's been a dream of mine to befriend a monster. I've been trying to find a monster to be my buddy ever since. In fact, just the other day, I spotted a group of really friendly looking goblins in Charred Passage. I'm sure they'd want to be pals with me. Right, I decided. I'm going to make friends with them. Bye! Okay, I think that might not be a, the greatest idea. <laughs> okay, so we need to definitely go to chart uh, passage. Uh, let's see how our supplies is. Hey, welcome. What can I get for you? Oh, they just sell candy. Damn. Come again. All the way back to twenty-six. Oh, that's still fine. Above up. forty would be better, but uh, we will not be uh, killed by this. Oh, just uh, outside of town. Mm, let's see where... Oh, also very close uh, near the entrance even. Yeah, I'm sure those goblins look very interesting, but uh, I doubt they will be really friendly. Yeah, only death quest. Good. Now let's see what kind of level we're facing here. I'm pretty sure it's going to be max level 30. If it's less, even better. Ah, someone help! Well, you won't believe what happened. The, those goblins looked all nice and welcoming, but they attacked me the moment I approached them. I'm going back to the village to get myself patched up. I leave the goblins to you. Aww, and he just wants to be friends. Oh, level 14? Not too bad. Oh, they technically were. Did he really try to befriend them, or did he just use me to get rid of some of them? At this point it could be either way, couldn't it? Well, it was an easy job nonetheless. So just walk all the way back. Ooh, I see a point I can play with. Right. I'm at no, 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 not yet, not yet. <laughs> I should not uh, accept my... Uh, Instinct to go exploring. <laughs> we were busy doing this quest before we head over to Guju. No distraction, not today. <laughs> mm. Shall we uh, go tell the guy off that he should Taking not this? try to befriend some monsters? There's no situation that would have uh, ended nicely. Ah, oh, well, I'm sorry for making you fight all those goblins on your own. I guess you were able to take care of them. Man, I feel bad about this. I, I didn't think it all through at all. Thanks for saving me. It's a little gift to show my appreciation. One step closer to becoming a true <laughs> Provoke. Well, this is what he did with the goblins, so... 
Good on you. And for us, time to move on to the next town over. Which is Long Run. Yes, uh, and there is a quest here. And of course, some woman to talk to to uh, see how they feel about their uh, extremities. First, the quest. Hey, hey uh, let me ask you a question. Have you ever tried grilled needle beak leg meat? No? Oh, boy, you're, you're missing out. It's the juiciest meat you've ever tasted. And it's packed with melt in your mouth flavor. Great. I'm getting the cravings again. Not the cravings. Say, could I ask you to find some needle back leg meat so I can grill some up and scratch this itch? Watch yourself though. Those uh, needle beaks are a mean sort. You should be especially wary of their beaks. If they catch you with a clean pack, there's no coming back. Alright. Well, since we are here... Right on the cliff, okay. Shall we talk to the person about their tail uh, first? I think that might be wise. That way when we find the monster we can just deliver it and quickly go away. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're not gonna single jump that. Oh, hello there. Can I help you with anything? You'd like to hear what I think about my tail? Sure, I suppose. Well, my tail is thicker and more sinewy than most people, but that never really bothered me that much. I like it, actually. I mean, it's pretty unique, don't you think? I'll admit that tending to it can be a tad tedious, but I just see it as an opportunity to pamper myself. <laughs> I hope that helps somehow. Yes, seeing yourself as a little bit special. And why not? Because everybody is unique in their own way. Sometimes people think that a bit too much, but in technical terms, yes, everybody is kind of unique. Uh, so, we have another item on the roof. Let's leave it at that, because by now we know that shinies come and go, but chests, they are forever. So let's uh, leave this place. Because I'm assuming with the flag that uh, the beaks that we are fighting is fine. We want to fight for the leg meat. It's gonna be outside here. Is there an area? <laughs> no. Uh, Guard needle beak leg meat. Just time three. No, that's not too bad. Uh, let's try and see if we can find some blue marks to hunt down. Use that as an opportunity to find those beaks. How's this? I'm at full strength. Well, good on you. <gasps> oh, yeah, those are definitely level three. <laughs> it's still the originals, yeah. Oh, I think I saw this in a book one time. Now, uh, compare that with the previous quest, where they were level 14, now they feel a lot higher than uh, they used to be. The dud bears will love this. Oh, that they would definitely do. Right. I'm at full strength. Ah, come on! Didn't want to miss that one. Okay, we're gonna try one more time. Maybe if we jumped in it a bit higher. Ooh, I got uh, thrown down straight away. Ah, uh, maybe we need to uh, have a greater attraction of uh, items. Oh well, that's for another time. We try twice, that is enough for now. Because we are on the hunt for beaks. Should we leave more than this uh, out there? Alright, let's activate this so we know where it is. Alright. 
Yeah, at some point we're gonna just dedicate one episode and just going by all these challenges. Or I'm gonna do them in between the episodes as a challenge, but uh, I haven't decided on that uh, one just yet. Those should be fish. Huh. I think I figured out why we only needed three, cause there are not a lot of uh, groups that have the same setup. Ah, there's one. Easy. That's the last. Let's keep moving. No, rabbits and tibits. Go back through the town. More rabbits. Ah, two of them. Yeah, that will definitely finish off our mark. Right, great. Ah, uh, just slightly. We should be off. Hey, you're back, and you found the meat. You didn't sustain any injuries while you were out hunting, right? Good, I'm glad to hear that. Alright then, time to fire up the grill and make some needleback skewers. Alright, let me give you a thank you gift for helping me out. Here, take this. I hardly use it anymore, so you can have it. I'm sure you find a better use for it than me. Helping out people in need can be so Ooh, rewarding. a spirit circle. Oh, we definitely want uh, something like that. Because the more we have, the more we can pick from. Alright, that's it for this town. A turn. Uh, no quest markers, because we know by now that you will see a quest marker if that's the case. Yeah, and this way we could also just... Uh, hmm, I am tempted to try those beasts at Mount Gala. Because I do feel that it's probably just one. I'm gonna head over uh, all the way to them and we're just gonna give it a try. Worst case, we die. <laughs> so I think I think it should be fine. Okay, we're here. Let's try it and let's hope they don't have uh, multiple uh, encounters and then we should be fine. Because we're just gonna overwhelm them with this. <laughs> but we'll see. <laughs> Alright. And um, thanks to the mill. And that's the old mill guy at Logren. We should be off. Don't worry, the poison will go away. Alright, uh, well, with a fully charged uh, move, it's a lot easier <laughs> than we thought it was gonna be. Yeah, it was just a chance of having multiple uh, encounters that was gonna be a problem if they had that. Oh, you take care of the monsters? Well, I'll be. I know you were the right uh, folk for the job. When the time's right, I'll take my apprentices up the windmill and start the repairs. Well, if you're ever back in the area, oh, do come say hello. Helping out people in need can be so rewarding. <laughs> yes, especially with the amount of cash we're getting. Yeah, the amount is ridiculous. I don't mind, I like a bit of extra cash, but that is a lot of money. Just for that, it's a good thing that the game has these side quests. Because the money you get from fighting enemies is, at least at this point, at the furthest reaches we can go, is like between 80 and 150 per Let's fight. Which door. is not a lot. And you not get a lot of items that you can actually use to uh, sell either. 
Uh, harbor, no encounters, but... <laughs> we don't have a chance to get close to the water, then let's do it like this. Alright, that means that this continent has been done. Uh, we have done the quest, so the only thing we have to do is get back to the other continent and deliver the quest in Istana for talking about our tales. So I will see you when we get there. Alright, we are back at the other continent and we also have a few quests here to do. And while we are making towards our location, let's grab some stuff here as well. Extra grizzlies, extra points, never a bad thing. Show us the wonders of mana. A welcome find. And after this one, we'll uh, also go and search for the crabs, which I imagine would be around the beach side. All right. Chest. What have you got? Interesting. Didn't think I'd uh, still have a chest uh, here on the floor. I grabbed the experience. All right, let's see. Worrisome? No, this is uh, high, but not impossible. Yeah, I'm summoning the tree. You should be fine. Yeah, there it is. Keep our plan alive. What the hell? Thank you, Jesus. I can help you. Damn, they this second group is a lot tougher than the first one, that's for sure. I can help you. If you can defeat at least one or two of them, that should already make things a lot more easier. Come on, summon some rabbits uh, to fight with us. There they are. Well, the experience should at least be good on this group. My mind is... I 
Yeah, that, uh, yeah, I imagine that <laughs> would have been that much of an increase. Good. And I was thinking about that in between the episode, that if we do boss fights, we might as well use an uh, experience enhancer, because it will give us uh, a lot of extras. But the experience we get from bosses are actually really decent. Uh, I guess that one's probably upside. Oh, crap. Sorry about that. Do you come back? Do we get a new bubble? Show us the wonders of man. I'm at full strength. Good, but uh, we did do it in the end, even if it was a little bit difficult, but being a little bit difficult, that's not a bad thing, is it? Because we do love a challenge every once in a while. Ooh, there's a special caterpillar. Hopefully we get some... This is very valuable. Yeah, it is a nemesis, but uh, uh, a nemesis that is uh, definitely a bit past its prime. I guess we need to be up there for that one. Uh, did we even explore this part of uh, this region? I think we did went up there. I think that's near where the ruins is, isn't it? Uh, somewhat. But uh, yeah, let's keep on focusing on the quest that we have. Uh, defeat the Quilted Hoots, report back your findings. Okay, so this is good. Back to Lekas Bay. This is the Pincers. Let's do that. Yeah, of course, at the beach. Now where's our next stop? Yeah, where else are you gonna find crabs, right? Because, uh, to be honest, I, I have no idea, because I'm assuming that crabs uh, live near the sea. I could be totally wrong, of course. And even the blue stuff, too. Ooh, Teslas. Yeah, we're not here for uh, squint. We are, well, jellyfish, I think, is mostly what it is. So, let's uh, find us some crab. Oh wait, is it taking us to an entirely different region? Oh, let's uh, look at that. Uh, a floor sent crab due to problems with pins you in the past. We released some trying to get some pins crab. Huh. Then I have no idea where this is. This, this is still the one that is on long play. Did he return to do this one? And these are the harpies of Kashmir Moors. Oh, I really thought I was here on the beach. I was wrong. Alright, so we need to go to the Moors and to wherever this quest uh, is we need for the Pinter uh, shells. I am rather curious to be honest. Yeah, that's for the Moors. So, I reckon that the one for the crab must be on one of the other isles. Hmm. Well, we do need to go to the other continent for uh, the quest, so... Let's beat the harpies, then deliver the quest that we have. That means they go to Ilistana, the bay, and wherever we need to go for the harpies. Uh, we probably need to mark the harpies if we want to see it on the map. Oh, we did. Let's collect ourselves before we set off. And where is it then? 
Well, it must be just enemies uh, lurking about just normally. So let's go to this one and just uh, travel through the area and see if we can find some harpies. Because it would make this quest uh, a lot easier if it's just a random uh, encounter enemy. Full strength. It's an imp and a needle line. Needle line. Yeah, let's just uh, focus on finding uh, the harpies. A way to get back off. Show us the wonders of mana. Yeah, I first want to get the grizzlies here. I'll be taking this. Good. Guess I'll sit back and enjoy the ride. Good. Guess I'll sit back and enjoy the ride. How can you not enjoy a ride like that? <laughs> ah, there they are. The harpies. Alright, so we have two. We just need to find three more, I think. <laughs> Very cool. Yeah, it looks. It sounds really, very, very cute. Uh, having a little kid uh, say something like that, even though that little kid is a very old man, isn't he? Cause he lived uh, along it since ancient times. For the other big high level group. Alright, two more. Perfect. Yeah, because usually when you find an enemy, never will be more in the same region. I don't want to travel too far away from where we are right now. Because we might miss them. So where would the last one be? I just need two more. Uh, technically, we just warp. We should be off. And then head in a general direction where we found them, and then we. Should find more flying about. Oh, unless, of course, I see elemental points. Let's continue. Well, we can leave You're those lying about. I do wonder, though, that uh, if we collect all those elemental points, will we even need the clovers? <laughs> Or is the game designed that you eventually will need uh, those uh, clovers in order to get everything? Mm. Well, where's our next stop? Right, it should be far enough away for them to respawn. At least that's what I'm betting on. Yeah, that they are. Very cool. Yeah. 
Return to the quest giver. Alright, above here, let us check out uh, Tsata if they have quests there too. Because I do really want to continue on with the main story, but I cannot in good coin just do that if there are side quests abound. Because it gives us way too much money in order to just leave it. Uh, let's see. Ah, that's the one we picked up here. Good. It's been a while. Almost forget about it with the much uh, we have traveled all over fighting numerous strong enemies. Oh, oh I see you took down those harpies. Nice, very nice. Here, take this as thanks. Five thousand and a strength serum. Damn, I feel like I'm being overpaid here for some reason. <laughs> Uh, no, 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 we're, we're, we're not gonna complain. We're not gonna complain. We're gonna accept and say thank you. <laughs> Let's rest up. Mm. Wait. A new quest popped up? Because it's an exact same location where we found the last one. Ooh, could it be another painting? It might. Oh no. Oh traveler, it's you! Oh, allow me to apologize for the way I acted last time. I shouldn't have sent you away like that, considering all you've done for me. I was going to tell you everything eventually, I swear. I didn't blame Mr. Doritoni, but that wasn't what I had in mind. It all came out so suddenly. I wasn't emotionally prepared. But I am now. And there's more you should know. My parents weren't of the same uh, social standing. My father was raised in poverty and my mother came from an affluent uh, family. Things were different back then. People believed in improper for a couple of such different backgrounds to wed. My mother's parents were the most bitterly opposed. Uh, they uh, thought father was only in it for the lucre. Uh, the thing they used to say about him don't bear repeating. Then one day, mother reached the end of her tether and ran away from home, never to return. When father heard what she has done, he packed his bag and eloped with her. They left Iristana and their old lives behind. Because of that, I grew up very poor as a child. Even so, we stuck together through hard times, no matter how bad things got. We knew we always had each other. I was happy just with that. Until the day everything changed. Well, there you have it. The sob story that is my life. <laughs> Sorry I had to hear it. Yet, you always listen to me so attentively, thank you. I feel good to get it all off my chest, I must say. Perhaps you could lend me your ears again in the future. You truly are a kind soul. Did you know that? I imagine you must get it a lot. Anyway, since you're here, there was something else I wanted to ask of you. In searching for the place in this painting, might you have a clue to where it's located? Uh, yes, I do. It looks to me like Preto Ridge, but I'm not sure precisely where. I'm sorry for asking of all these favors, but please know that I always appreciate your help. Oh, okay, so there might be new quests popping up from the same people that gave it to us first. Damn, that means there could potentially be uh, a dozen more quests laying about. Also, while we're here, uh, I want to check to see if Niccolo has some new stuff in store. Because we shouldn't forget about that. Wait. Even he has quest for us? Yeah, we're, we're, we're busy. <laughs> hmm, I'm in a bit of a bind here. Oh, hello Niccolo. Everything okay? You're looking a little worried here. Oh, hey there, Val. Oh, I, I, if I'm looking down, it's because of a good customer of mine placed an order, but the shipment uh, for it suddenly got cancelled. I could try another supplier, but it's unlikely that the merchandise will arrive in Ivistana before the deadline. Ordinarily, uh, I take matters in my own paws in a time like this. Unfortunately, I'm a bit short-staffed at the moment. 
Well, in that case, where do we get the items for you, father? Ah, Morty, what am you saying? I can't have the alms running errands for my private businesses. Oh, nonsense, Niccolo. You've always been an invaluable ally to us. I insist. Hmm, besides, I feel guilty not helping you when you so obviously need it. That's right. You can leave it, uh, this one to us, Niccolo. <laughs> Let us help you out. Oh, well, all, all right then. Thank you, Mew. I must admit, it's comforting to know that Mew are so willing to help. <laughs> so, what do you need us to find for you? Oh, I, I need Mew to get her some uh, harpy down. Fishes as they may be, harpies have lovely plumage, and their feathers are always in high demand. Too true, father. I have many memories of you heading out to procure them uh, yourself. Oh, Mew ho ho! I am surprised Mew still remember that. Anyway, the nearest place to uh, where Mew can find harpies are Dura Gorge and the Kaishwia Moors. Oh, how many pinions do we produ procure? Oh, six uh, down feathers uh, ought to be enough. Oh, well then, I'll leave Mew to it. Okay, so basically, if we got here before we did the Sata quest, we would have gotten two uh, birds literally with one stone. Oh, that's fine. We know where it is, so that makes it easier as Welcome. well. What can I get for you? Uh, normal items. Boss debuffs and status effects. We should have this in the wheel as well. Uh, at least our cars are getting uh, up to normal levels again. Redeem Niccolo coins. Yeah. Please come again. That is definitely something for in between the episodes. Good. But uh, let us first deliver the one quest that we have here. Then we can go to Prita Ridge for the painting because we know roughly where we need to be. And then we can hunt some more harpies before we uh, move on forward. Oh. Uh, hi again, sir. Did you manage to ask around? Hmm. Ah, interesting. So to summarize, the people you interviewed consider their tales to be an important part of who they are as people. See, Lilithi, not everyone in the world is born with a fluffy tail, but they're still proud of them nonetheless. Oh, you're right. I I'm sorry there's something I can do to love my tail, like brushing it better or whatnot. I'm going to look for some uh, silk tails. <laughs> Wait, Lady T, it's dangerous to go alone. Please, could you follow Lady T and make sure she doesn't get hurt? That we can do. So, where is she <laughs> going for uh, the tails? Is it going to be outside this town? Yeah, pretty rich. That's fine. We have to be there anyway. Uh, where was the other one that we already completed? That is... Oh, that's the harbor. All right. Where to next? First, let's get out of town and see if we can find where the picture was taken. Unless, of course, uh, Lilithi is quite close to the entrance of here. Uh, let's see, all the way over there. Yeah, I think we can best uh, have a quick run. Oh, having said that, lately I've been forgotten that <laughs> we have uh, some magical beast that can uh, help us travel a lot faster. We shouldn't forget about them. They are very helpful indeed. Supposed to be somewhere on this ridge, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. Ah, this should be the place in Darnie's painting. At least I think it is. Hmm, looks to me. He must have been facing this direction as he painted the city. 
But on a close inspection, the angle seems a little off. Lower, perhaps? Could he have been sitting on the uh, edge of the cliff? <laughs> well, it seems like he uh, go to any lengths to achieve perfection. Uh-oh. <laughs> Hold that thought, everyone. We got company to deal with. Monster company. Uh, correct. Let us conquer these creatures as we may continue our contemplations. Yeah, let's wait to see if there are reinforcements or if this is everything. But the first group, if there are reinforcements, are always the easy ones. I don't want to shoot my load straight on the first one again because this the move is way too powerful. So we'll get rid of everyone straight away. I knew it, I knew it. It's gonna be a third group. Yes, run. Perfection. And through his quest, surely we're getting closer and closer to be even with them. Phew, I'm glad that's over with. I'll go tell Fiona we find the spot. Ah, oh, the long bridge to Ilistana, the vast ocean, the majestic coastline. And are those ruins I see in the distance? Oh, the scale of it all is jaw-dropping to say the least. I could stay here all day and night. Well, I told you your father suddenly disappeared one day, didn't I? He just up and left, leaving mother and me alone. I was only a child back then. I had no idea what I was supposed to do. I desperately wanted to know why I would do such a thing, but no answer ever came. All I ever wished for was the three of us to live happily as a family. Was that too much to ask? Thank you for always listening. I think I'll stay here and enjoy the view uh, some more before I return to Istana. This isn't so bad. Uh... Oh, I wonder what you two talked about in this very spot. Something very profound, I'm sure. We should be off. Yes, we should. Okay. Should we really close down there? Let's hope it's not the, another big old group. Eh, maybe it is. We'll see. Oh, I'm sorry, please don't get mad. I guess silk tails don't like their tails being touched. What am I gonna do now? Lutie, are, are you okay? Get the safety, understand? Okay, please, sir, be careful. It's just silk tails, we should be able to get that. Oh, I just never learned. I don't know why I feel bad. A little. Understood. Uh, are you all right? You're not hurt, are you? Oh, you're super strong, sir. I've never seen anything like it. Oh, sorry, everyone. I really messed up big time. Lilithy, why did you suddenly run off like that? Didn't you think it might be dangerous? I. Well, since my tail is as bushy, isn't as bushy as yours, I thought that... I figured you were embarrassed to be seen with me because my tail isn't very fluffy. Let me ask you this then, Lady T. If my tail wasn't the way it is, would you stop being my friend? What? Of course I wouldn't. You're always going to be my friend no matter what kind of tail you have. <gasps> See? The same goes for me, Lady T. Friendship isn't about whose tail looks like what. I'm your friend because I want to be your friend. Similarly as that, I never thought about how your tail looked. And as your friend, it always hurts me to see you so insecure. Oh, Mike. Thank you. I feel a little better today. So, does it mean we're still friends forever? <laughs> forever and ever. Come on, uh, Lady T. I think we should head back to Ilistana soon. Yeah, let's go together. 
Oh, thanks again for your help. See you around. I completed many a similar odd job in the past. Yeah. Good kids, but they really should uh, take better care of themselves. But that was very dangerous. Uh, so yes, we have to go back to the moor. Shall we get back to Litkus Bay and hunt the harpies again on the next one? I think that might be we should be a off. good choice. That way, all the quests we have completed will be delivered. And we can focus on the last few ones that we still have left. Like, we have like two or three more regions that I want to check to see if there are any quests. But as soon as we're done with that, we can, uh, well, we can move on to Guju. Oh wait, we just passed the guy. Oh, hey there. How's the Quilt and Hood uh, cleanup coming along? You beat them. Thanks. I'll be sure to tell the other merchants that you cleared the road of those nasty quilted hoods. Here's your reward. I know it's not much, but I'm sure you can find a use for it. Helping out people in need can be so rewarding. Oh, definitely. A lot of money is very rewarding, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, I don't think there's anything else in town. No, everything looks really nice. Very good. Alright, so let's leave it here for today. On the next one... We'll, well, we'll complete the ones we have. We'll look at the few regions uh, we still have to look out for. Because there would be... Uh, well, there's a nature area I still want to check out. And we have learned that through the quick travel menu we can check the area to see if there are quests. We don't actually have to go there. So we will see if there are there. If there is none, we don't have to. If there are, we go there, pick up the quest and fulfill them. So that uh, once we get uh, to Guju, we have done everything. And when the game progresses, we have enough money and a high enough level to take care of everything we need. But for now, I wish you all a great night, morning, day, wherever you are. And if you're still here, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe and be back next time. Because we have just a little bit more to go before uh, we head to Guju. But for now, good night. Bye bye.